This week in Arctic Entertainment news, we got news on Arctic Entertainment's 10th anniversary event. It will span all of Arctic Entertainment's games, including AQ Worlds, Epic Duel, Dragon Fable, MechQuest, Hero Smash, and the original Adventure Quest. The release will go live next Friday, October 12th at 6 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Also, there is a ton of stuff coming later this month, including Hero Mart will release the 2013 calendar and the 10th anniversary shirt, some more games birthdays, wedding event, and a special When I Doll music video. Hey everyone, this week in Oversoul, the release is Experience Gold and a ton of other features. First up, Gold, Experience, and this new mysterious SG. Uh, I'm guessing this, this SG is what you buy the secondary payment system. You use real money on Arctic points to purchase this. Also, you've been accumulating gold for shops that will eventually open up. And character tree, right now, my Fire Witch is a level 2 and about 25%. You can level all your characters up to level 20. And as you level up, you can increase life points. And eventually, there will be more features added on to that. Also, when clicking on character, this new field comes up with the duel and add a friend. The PvP duel is the feature coming soon where you can duel that person. And Ed Friend, the friend management system is coming soon, but the report system is in game. And lastly, this release, the new screen shot button, you click on that, and it'll freeze it, and it'll show up my screenshot, where you can just right click the image and save image as. They'll save image as should show up in Google Chrome, Opera, Firefox, Internet Explorer. You save the image and then just go to Twitter, Facebook, or it'll just save to your computer if you want to upload it somewhere. And then at the bottom, there's this close screenshot button. You can close it, and you'll be back in game. That's this week's release in Oversoul. This week in Adventure Quest Worlds, Taco Day went live on Thursday. You can visit the shop to get some Taco Day items, as well as do the quest to get the Taco Mancer armor. This week, it's a death release. The release walkthrough will be up later tonight or tomorrow, Saturday, October 6th. And also, the hub town of Magoween has returned. Stay tuned for previous Magoween tutorial walkthroughs. New Magoween content will be coming later this month. Also, for any founders out there, the Chaos Armored Platinum Dragon is yours to get. It has already been added to your account. If it is not, please contact Arctic Entertainment. Also, if you are a fourth upholder, you can visit the badges page and then scroll down right below the third upholder. You'll get the fourth upholder. And this year they added the badge shop. So you click get item and there are now two star swords to choose from. Both of them go along with the chaos naval commander, but they do not really match the other naval commander. This week in Epic Duel, it is patch 1.4.9H. There is a new 4-key promo containing 20 hairstyles, including 3 new Evil Corp styles. Unlocking a hairstyle will now unlock that style across all classes. Note that all styles are not available on all classes. Players that have already purchased the same style in different classes have been refunded any varium spent on the extra styles. There are 18 new Evil Corp styles, 3 per class and gender. And also, there are more Evil Corp henchmen around Fortune City. This week in Dragon Fable, head to the Falcon Reach docks and explore the Falcon Reach Bay. Head up and then left. And right here, the docks will be unlocked. This week in MechQuest, MechQuest turns 5 years old. You can head into Tech Mechs for new special items.
this week in Adventure Quest Classic, the Talidosian set, The Power of Pisonics.